11. Now from CBS 6, the Weather Authority, Chief Meteorologist Zach Daniel. All right, today another very pretty day. A lot of sunshine out there for today, but a chilly day as well. This air mass is taking a little while to uh, modify and warm up a little bit. 22 this morning, 45 this afternoon. And it's late December and it certainly feels like it here. Look at the record 75 and not too long ago back in 2015. There were several days in the mid 70s. That was quite a stretch. And uh, while that does seem awfully comfortable right now, it's uh, definitely not Christmassy to have that kind of weather around. Right now it's 32 degrees outside and we have a very light southeast wind. Dew point at 28. Expect in some areas where skies really clear out. There's going to be a pretty heavy frost in the morning but there is high thin overcast that's rolling into the area and that's keeping temperatures from tanking in most areas. We do have some 20s out there, but it's nowhere near as cold as it's been this time for the last uh, couple of nights at this time. All right, up top there are those clouds, high thin clouds rolling into the area and uh, back to the west. Got some rain through parts of Ohio and Indiana and Kentucky. Notice this is rain though. It's not snows. So that's an indication that it's warmer air mass here ahead of the front. But that front will come on through here as we get into tomorrow night. Look at the air behind it. 17 in Minneapolis, zero up in Thunder Bay. It won't be that cold around here, but it will get colder on Tuesday. Lows tonight will be in the upper 20s and low 30s with highs tomorrow making it into the low and mid 50s. So just having a five in front of the uh, number for the high temperature is a little bit of a victory here after a couple of very cold days. So tomorrow's going to be overall pretty comfortable. We'll have a mix of clouds and sunshine 49 by noon, a high of 52 and a southwest breeze at 5 to 15 miles per hour. So here it is hour by hour rest of tonight. Just occasional clouds around and tomorrow a mix of clouds and sunshine. And then late tomorrow, the cold front will move in. This one should come through dry, though. There's not enough moisture and there won't be enough convergence along the front. So the front will come through. Northwest winds will pick up tomorrow night on into Tuesday. And Tuesday will be a sunny but cold day. And then Wednesday, just a kind of a partly cloudy and chilly day with highs in the mid to upper 40s. All right, checking out the temperature trend here. This pretty much sums up uh, winter in Virginia. We'll have highs in the 40s. 50s, 60s, and possibly 70s all within the next week. And that's a big warm up here. That's due to a big storm system coming in for New Year's Eve and New Year's Day. This one's going to bring us some rain, maybe even a few thunderstorms as well, and a good bit of wind as that system comes on through. It's not too different than the one that we just had over Christmas Eve and Christmas Day. It won't have the higher end threat for severe weather, though, that we had. There's a look at your seven day forecast. And there's that chance of rain, 60% New Year's Eve, 80% New Year's Day. A good chance that we'll have some showers around as we ring in the new year and say so long to 2020. Sean's coming up next with sports. You sign up for this job and it is what it is. Um, 